All right, final video is going to be the upstairs. Again, the carpet is just in pristine condition. No stains, no tracks. When you come upstairs, you have to go to the right or to the left. We'll start off by going to the left. Master bedroom. Master bedroom is definitely large, probably 18 by 16 or so. It has the huge walk-in closet. Tons of shelving, organizers, cubbies. And this closet is just absolutely massive. Hard to get it all on video. Master bathroom has a tile floor. It does have a single vanity. A really large mirror runs the whole length of the vanity. A really nice soaking tub. It has steps going into it. Tile surround around it. Nice view of that little hollow outside the tub. You do have your own toilet room. And you have a walk-in shower as well. And it's a tile shower. A little soap nook. There's a little soap ledge. It has a large rain head on it. Very nice. You have the laundry room upstairs, convenient to all the bedrooms. It has a vinyl floor. Of course, washer and dryer hookup. It's an electric dryer. It has a huge bench. Nice hanging area. Inside this little closet right here, that is actually a pull-out, fold-down ironing table. Guest bathroom, tile floor, tile surround around the tub. The tub is fiberglass, single vanity. Guest bedroom number one. This bedroom looks to be probably about 14 by 10, maybe 14 by 11. No crown mold up here. Of space though. There's our closet for the guest bed. Just kind of your run of the mill closet, probably 24 inches deep, about 36 inches wide. Guest bedroom number two they use as an office. It's a little bit larger perhaps than that first guest bedroom. And this one has a larger closet as well. Yeah, this one has a large walk-in closet. He doesn't have much shelving in here it's for hanging clothes, but you could certainly add some shelving. Very large closet space. Keep going down our hallway. And this is kind of a bonus room. You could call it a bedroom, has a closet, has a window. This is their crafting area. 
It's a, it's a large room. It's the whole width of the house. It does have a closet. Got your upstairs HVAC unit in this closet. And then just a little bit of shelving. In this room, they do have the same vinyl glue down tile that they had in the basement. This bonus room is kind of split in half. It leads to another half of the bonus room. This bonus room is really interesting because it's larger than the first bonus room and it has a sink. Hot and cold water. And that's the entire upstairs.